Each year, the Clean Energy Program here at the Pew Charitable Trust releases an annual assessment of trends in the global clean energy economy. The report's entitled, Who's Winning the Clean Energy Race? In addition to looking at global trends, we also rank how countries are performing in what we think of as the global clean energy race for investment around the world. So our data looking at the year 2012 in the sector identified four key trends. First, we're finding that investment has shifted from the kind of mature sectors of the West to emerging sectors in the East. Also, we have found a shift in technologies. Investment that usually had gone to wind is now going to solar. Third, we have found that countries outside the G20 are a new destination for clean energy finance and investment. And finally, although investment declined by 11% globally to $269 billion, interestingly, we have seen increased installed capacity. So less finance is going farther because of rapidly declining prices for technologies. Over the last several years, China and the United States have been jockeying for leadership when it comes to attracting private finance in the clean energy sector. While last year the United States led, this year China is the clear global leader with $65.1 billion of finance and investment. The United States underperformed with a drop of investment, moving down to just $35.6 billion. Our conclusion, once again, is that policy matters wherever you are in the world. Those countries that have long-standing, consistent, ambitious, clean energy and policies in place, no matter what they are, are outperforming their colleagues who do not. Congress and the President need to work together to enact clear, consistent, long-term energy policies that will give investors, businesses, and others the certainty they need to invest, to hire workers, to manufacture the technology that we largely invented and to export it around the world.